I believe this is a switch pod. Um, I've had it on order for quite a while. Um, you may have seen the Kickstarter, like Pete McKinnon did, uh, did shouted it out, and Matty Hapuya and all that lot. Um, Apoya, Matty Apoya, I think. Sorry, Matty. I know you're probably not watching this because you're, you know, too popular. But yeah, you are. You are one of my inspirations, lad. So, um, anyway, yeah, bad start to it because I'm. Um, I'm pretty sure I paid for the customs at, at point of sale, and as you can see here, I had to pay basically 21 pounds to pick this this up, which I'm not happy about. So I'm gonna have to look into that. But uh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. Here we are. It is. It is the switch pod. Uh, this thing here. Um, obviously, any vlogger will tell you this is actually a very good idea. Um, you definitely want your camera on a ball head, I think, on top of it. But let's have a quick look and a quick unboxing and all that jazz. Um, we'll do this and then we'll go. In fact, let's, uh, let's get a, a top-down camera as well. Yeah, so this is the SwitchPod, um, a minimalist handheld tripod. Um, and you may have seen things already. So made by creators for creators. Um, and yeah, you might have seen this already. And for tips and tricks, go to switchpod.co.co slash start. So, oh, it's actually properly metal. Nice. Okay. There we go. Hopefully this is on, on camera right now. It is good. And the idea is that you've got your camera you know, like that, with your camera on top and your, and your mic and everything. And then... Tripod. <laughs> that is so cool. See if I can get that in shot on here as well. So it's here. There we go. So yeah, the idea is, you, you know, you've got it vlogging and, uh, you know, with your camera there pointing this way. And then you get to a table and... <laughs> hey, there you go. That's pretty cool. What is it, magnet? So it looks like there's there's quarter 20 threads around the top here for attaching whatever, I suppose. Just put some ball heads on there and some mics or whatever. And there's magnets on the bottom right there, um, which hold it in place, in theory. Yeah. The magnets aren't as strong. I thought they'd be a bit stronger, but it's it's, it's fine, it, it locks, and then you just uh, put your, screw your camera on, on like that. There you go, nice and simple. Yeah, so this basically, you know, you can be walking along and it's just at the right angle as well to, you know, for 24 mil lens or something like that, and then shoo, stick it on a table, carry on talking, ba da 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 ba, and then you're, you're off again. Um, that's pretty cool, because um, obviously, like everyone else, when vlogging, I've been using one of these, which is fine, but the, you know, by design, the ball heads, I mean, this one, this this is like really wobbly now because it's quite an old one. You know, and you have to kind of wangle it in and do that. You know, it's fine, you get the knack for it, but then to get like straight on a tripod kind of a thing, you kind of have to like, and then you carry on. Whereas if, with something like this, so picking it up's not too bad, but then you have to get like the angle right. So like that. But with this, once I finish talking, oof! Oh yes, yeah. But so far, seems all right, doesn't it? And a bit of all right, it was too. Now, unfortunately, this is after I recorded these bits and these uh, bits of B-roll you're seeing here. COVID nineteen happened, and uh, we all went into lockdown. So I haven't had that much time to uh, vlog with it. But from what I managed to, to get and what I managed to test, it's a very nice piece of kit. In the interest of balance, there are some negatives to compared to, say, the Gorilla Pod, in that, yes, you can put it down on the ground, like uh, you've seen here on the video, but you need to make sure it's a flat piece of ground, whereas with the Gorilla Pod, of course, you can wrap it around a tree branch or stick it on an uneven bit of land and, and you know, adjust the legs accordingly. Um, so what you gain in speed and ease of use with the switch pod you you lose in terms of functionality you know if you're 
you know, hiking or something like that, I probably wouldn't bring that along if you print it on rocks and things. But, you know, if you're vlogging, especially in the city, plenty of flat surfaces everywhere, you know, electrical boxes and uh, walls and stuff like that, absolutely perfect. Now, of course, in the interests of balance, um, my review unit did actually break. Um, I think it might have been user error, though. I'm not sure. Um, but, but just to give you a heads up, um, basically, I put a quick loose plate onto the top of the switch pod. And either I over tightened the screw itself or just the screw that, you know, from factory was, was you know, a faulty one. Because the top of the mounting screw just sheared right off um, and got stuck inside the uh, quick release plate. But again, in interest of balance, I did contact SwitchPod about this and they couldn't have been more helpful. They immediately sent out a uh, replacement screw and I even made a little video on how to take the SwitchPod apart and uh, replace the screw there. And yeah, my experience with the actual customer service side of things couldn't have been better. So props to SwitchPod for that. Absolutely brilliant. But yeah, if you ever had any problems with with your SwitchPod, if you get one, then just contact them directly and just be honest with them what's happened and... Uh, They'll obviously use that research to, you know, I, I suppose make version 2 better. But I'm also confident that they will solve your issues very quickly and and very courteously as well. But that's it for this review. Thanks for watching. Um, stick around for the outtakes at the end um, if you want to see me make a fool of myself. And um, um, search for Team Reflector on, uh, you know, Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, all that stuff. Until next time, I've been Moobit. You have been Awesome Source. And I'll see you in the next video. Ta-ra! And this is the part where we're recording um, the B-roll for the sequence where I'm talking over the top of the uh, of the camera to give you my final thoughts on this uh, tripody thing. What they don't realise is I'm talking complete and utter bollocks. And I can say shooba doo ba doo boo but I'm ba scabba da ba doo ba ski ba ba dee ba and it doesn't really matter you see because you can't even hear it except for all the credits at the end if you stay towards the end so you know see we're just walking along in the background going squee ba blue ba flee ba flu ba flare squee ba blue blah blah you see it just doesn't make any sense whatsoever i'm telling you i'm just yeah yeah guys so you're walking along you're vlogging you're vlogging you come to a two oh maybe not Wash your hands, wash your hands, wash your hands. Wash your hands, wash your hands, wash your hands. Wash your hands, wash your hands, wash your hands. Wash your fing hands! I like to move it, move it, fit, fit, fit.